What is going on, everybody? All right, this the upcoming video is uh, from an hour-long conversation. I want to get on and just have diarrhea of the mouth this evening because <laughs> I'm going to test out a couple things. I've been having problems occasional. Once a blue moon of my Thetis, the Thetis software, uh, kind of freezing up and, and it was shut off one time. And one other time it completely jammed up. So I'm trying to get to the bottom of that. I, I did something a little bit different this evening uh, before this conversation. It's kind of le might lead me to uh, the core issue. But I don't know yet, so I'm not going to say anything. So, anyhow, yeah, this is just... If you try to follow the context of the conversation, you won't because it's <laughs> highly edited. But uh, everything's slowly starting to come into place. And, uh, sorry, I'm getting... Uh, I think I'm coming out with another cold slash flu. I better do this this evening. Load this up, this pre-ramble of the, of the video. Because tomorrow I'm probably going to be sick in bed. <clears throat> so, pardon my horrible voice. Worse than usual, and then my, another part of this video, I had uh, Mike from Seven Forty Two do the frequency calibration on his and on G Two Ultra, get him on frequency. So I wanted to also load this up for him, so you could hear the before and after. But uh, anyhow, all right, let's get on into it, and uh, I'll check you guys later whenever I'm feeling better. KP sixty eight. Let's do this. You know, receive not not the filter, but the 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 actual receive frequency. Uh, I I didn't really notice anything different like i mean if i went up or down it didn't get better it didn't get worse uh so i would say you're you're pretty much spot on <clears throat> okay here's what i want you to do uh go to your setup tab all right let me uh, go there now click on general okay now on the sub tabs click on calibration let me know when you do that All right, yeah, I'm on the uh, old calibrate right now. You want me to hit start? Should I blast it with uh, the foot pedal down? Uh, no, no. When you put start, you don't touch anything. You don't key up. You just hit start. But uh, try it one more time. Go ahead and start. You don't key. <clears throat> don't key the radio. Just hit start. All right. And then what I want you to do. Tell me what that correction factor is down where it says HP SDR freak cal diagnostic. Now, uh, tell me what that number is. Wait, where am I looking again? You said uh, hit the start button and then the HP SDR freak cal diagnostic correction factor. Uh, you want me to tell you what that is, which is obviously the next uh, section down, correct? All right, here we go. Okay, we are keying up and talking right now, which I'm sure you probably put your frequency calibration to that, uh, <coughs> whatever I sent you there. But, uh, hello, radio, one, two, three, four, five. Well, would you look at that? Uh, well, I mean, what? I don't understand how it would get off frequency. Um, because, I mean, I don't do it all the time, but uh, what What do you think would make it get off frequency like that? hit on zero. All right, well, maybe I'll just leave it on zero then, because uh, like I said, I didn't notice anything in the watt meter. I wasn't watching the Thetis watt meter either. Uh, it's only showing anywhere from 12 to 16, 15 watts peak output. But uh, I don't know, man. I'm probably going to get out of here. i got a busy day again tomorrow. And uh, with that being said, uh, I don't know. It was fun. Always the old test and tune, screwing around. Too bad we didn't have more uh, more people like us more of our kind on this here be fun. Uh, this evening I had no uh, no signs of uh, you know the software glitching out got the cakewalk all up I have all my uh, like a lot of, the screen looks spectacular I got all my uh, four plugins here showing my weight audio waveform got that going and uh, yeah that's uh, very smooth this evening so anyhow uh, yeah thanks for getting on here and to me <laughs> jibber jabber sorry i'm a little bit distracted because i'm uh, constantly looking at my equipment make sure everything's good but uh yeah that was fun but uh, all right yeah get some sleep 
then uh, hopefully a little one there is uh, fine tomorrow. No more, no more getting a uh, stomach upset on you. All right there, Mr. Pizzle. Uh, I don't know if the signal went up any or not, but uh, I'd be curious if it did. Uh, it doesn't seem like it did. I went up a little bit more in output power, but uh, let me know if I gained an S unit or not. I'm going to say no, but uh, you never know. <clears throat> uh, maybe it didn't show it on the meter, but I could see on the S meter... It, it goes above, a little bit above eight, but it'll still show eight, uh, show eight on the uh, on the readout, digital readout, but it is, it fluttered above eight. And I uh, don't mean, need much on sideband, but I did notice a little bit uh, increase in the audio. Okie dokie, well, I'm back to my normal uh, output power here. But uh, all right there, Pizzle. We're going to get out of here, buddy, and uh, hopefully you and the missus feel better. And uh, we'll talk to you tomorrow. <laughs> Maybe we can get some more talk time in either tomorrow or Sunday. Uh, but until then, my friend, 73 is from World Radio 742, Pennsylvania. All right, there, Mike. All right, take care. God bless. And uh, yeah, I'll talk to you tomorrow. It's going to be interesting uh, to see how I feel when I wake up tomorrow morning. So anyhow... All right, Mike, 73, and it's been KP68 out here in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. I'm going to leave you with the playback, 742. Catch you later. Here you go. One last playback, and I'm out of here. And either tomorrow or Sunday, uh, but until then, my friend, 73, is from World Radio 742, Pennsylvania.